This video deals with domain 5 concept. Single sign on, also known as SSO. So, what is single sign on? As the picture suggests, single sign on is nothing but single key for all the logs, that is, single user ID and password for all the applications. It is a user authentication service that permits a user one set of login credential that is name and password to access multiple applications. Advantages of single sign-on Multiple passwords not required. This encourages user to select a stronger password. Administrator's ability to manage user's account improved. Also helps in reduction of administrative overhead cost. Reduces time taken by user to login into multiple applications. Some of the disadvantages. Okay, single authentication point for multiple application. Major risk. Support of all major operating system environment is difficult. So, this was already being asked in CISA exam. Major risk of SSO is it acts as a single authentication point for multiple application, hence single point of failure. So, point to remember for CISA exam. When CISA question is about major risk of SSO, our answer should be it acts as a single authentication point for multiple applications or it acts as a single point of failure. But if both the options are there, we need to select the first one that is single authentication point of multiple application because this is more specific answer as compared to SSO acts as a single point of failure. Also, when CISA question is about most important control for SSO, our answer should be implementation of strong password policy. So what is the Kerberos? It is one example of single sign. So here, both server and user, they need to authenticate themselves. Let us discuss some CISA question. An organization is introducing a single sign-on. So what is the major risk? Now here, if you see option A and B, both are right. But major risk is single authentication point for multiple applications. If first option is not there, then we need to select option B because option B is the result of the option A. So here, unauthorized access in SSO will have major impact. Again, major risk of using SSO. It will have greater impact. All other are the characteristic of SSO. It basically improves the ability of manager. It reduces time and it decreases the workload of security administrator. Risk of unauthorized access can be best controlled by
So this unauthorized access can be controlled by Kerberos, its authenticate server as well as user. Most important action. When CSA question is about most important control for SSO, our answer should be implementation of strong password policy. So benefit of single sign on. Administration of password management. Thanks for watching. For more such video, please visit datainfosec.com.